on guys. Well today we're looking at this new plasmatic lighter. This is their latest version of their lighter and it's called the VO. Uh, pretty interesting, very uh, cool new design. You can see you have a removable cap. All right, and the top is totally exposed here. And the biggest benefit to this is to get down deep inside of candles. So I'm gonna give you a demo. Actually, let's show you right now. Real quick though, there's a safety feature on this. So if you hit it once, it won't work. That's to prevent kids from accidentally, you know, lighting stuff on fire and playing with it. You have to do a uh, double tap. So one, two, and I hold it down, it stays on. You can see we have the uh, cross pattern here. Okay, it's even more effective. Every generation that comes out is a little bit better than the one previous. Originally it was just one little line, then they made it two lines, and then it was like making noise, it was too loud, so now it's quiet. And this new design, I really like the most of all of them. But also, if you notice, we have our battery power indicator on here as well. All right, so we have a flameless lighter with lots of capability. So as far as uh, charging, it does come with a uh, charging cable, USB to micro USB. So you can see the port is on the bottom here. So you just plug that in and it plugs into any USB port to charge, which is very nice and convenient. So let's give you a quick uh, demo here with this uh, candle. Again, because the button is set down low, you have the capability of reaching down into something. All right, so give this a, a double tap. Okay, put that right on the end of our, our wick. And there you go, very simple, right? Try it again. And it just takes a quick touch, generating quite a bit of heat. So you do want to be careful with this, okay? You can't hurt yourself if you uh, obviously come in contact with that. But uh, pretty cool. Try one more time. Actually lit the, <laughs> the gas is coming up. I'll light this off the smoke. Maybe, maybe not. But anyway, works well. So no complaints there whatsoever. And they also sell an accessory, which I think is just as cool as the lighter, to be honest. And that is this. They have their own alcohol swabs. All right. So you read the back here, it's uh, isopropyl alcohol and water mix inside of a Q-tip. Okay, so obviously, specifically if you're using this for cigarette um, lighting, I mean, obviously you're going to get build up with any kind of, uh, you know, even lighting candles, you get ash build up. But more specifically with, uh, with cigarettes, you'll get little bits of burnt tobacco and stuff that stick towards your, your uh, prongs here. So all you do is take one of these, snap the end just like that. Okay, hold upside down, you can see all that fluid gets soaked up into the tip of your swab. And you can come in here and clean up the little uh, ends here to make sure there's nothing in the way. Because after a while, with lots of use, it does get nice and dirty. All right, then you have a dry side. If you have any extra moisture or anything there. So that, like I said, is equally as cool. Even if you are interested in the lighter, you might want to get these just for other applications. I think a, a pack like this is like six bucks. Just a very cool new design, really like it. Um, I like the old ones, but this one's even better. But I mean, there's a lot of applications, uh, I think most effective for regular cigarette smokers, obviously. But um, something as simple as just being at a birthday party, lighting the candles on a cake. I wish I had a, a birthday cake here with a bunch of candles to show you, but instead of getting your lighter and lighting one, and then you know grabbing another candle, lighting it off of that, and trying to get all those candles lit, and you literally just be like zzz, 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 and they're all lit, so. Pretty cool new design, Plasmatic VO. You can see we're down one as far as our, our power here from playing around with it. I already did charge this up, didn't take all that long. I didn't keep track of how long it took, but I had it plugged in for like maybe two hours and I think I had half the power down and it charged right up. So I don't know the exact time, I'm sure you could figure that out from their website. Only disadvantage to this design again is the, uh, the cap being separate, but you know, if you use some common sense, you won't have any problems, but if you're, you know, one of those people that just tend to lose things, that may be an issue for you. But obviously keeps the dirt and stuff out. You don't need the cap for anything, but you wouldn't want to have that loose in your pocket, because although there is a, a safety feature, you could accidentally bump it twice, you know, and light your pants on fire. So the cap obviously is important. And for all the gearheads that don't smoke or light candles, you could still burn the end of your paracord as well. All right. Same thing, stick it in there, rotate around. And now we have our sealed paracord. 
Very nice. All right, let's do the other side. There you go. Nice and sealed. All right, so anywhere you need fire, this can probably do the job. Uh, like I said, I haven't used this on larger gauge cigars yet, but for small cigarillos, it actually worked really, really well. So yeah, it's pretty cool. I like it a lot. But, word of warning, uh, be careful, be cautious. I will show you a quick little clip of me zapping myself. That's right, if you're wondering how this feels to uh, you know, put against your skin, it hurts. <laughs> you feel the electricity it actually went up my hand and into my arm, and it felt extremely hot, like I was getting burned by something. Uh, luckily, I hit myself right here. You'll, I'll show you the video clip at the end of the video here. But I was showing how to uh, to plug this in, and I literally had this by my hand. The head was right there, and I'm trying to plug it in, and I must have hit the button twice, and it got me. So uh, it does hurt. Be careful, and uh, don't do dumb stuff like I do sometimes. You know, human being, things happen, and luckily it didn't uh, didn't burn me or anything. But uh, I'll tell you what, it hurt. So just be cautious. <laughs> but anyway, you can check out that clip right now. Now as far as uh, charging, there's a little port right here. It does come with a charging cable. So USB to micro USB. All right, this just plugs in the bottom here. You can stick this in your computer. Or where <laughs> there you go. Hopefully you had a good laugh on me. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll see you soon. Take care.